got footage on it, so if we lose that, I'll shoot myself. So, if you don't want me to shoot myself. <laughs> Next time I go to Indiana, I'll be there for more than <clears throat> less than a day. <laughs> <laughs> I told him when he's in America, we'll take him canoe camping as an extreme yeah, opposite. <laughs> Okay, Andrew and Brian are both on their way. Hopefully they have a good flight. I think I got them on the train, okay? They didn't come back out, so hopefully. Right now, I'm in this park. It's Ueno something park, but I'm not sure what exactly. Michael's gonna meet me, and we're gonna do some thrift shopping as we always do. But until then, I'm gonna walk around and explore. So that's actually the Tokyo Sky Tree. I never went there in the vlog last time, but when I came here in 2012 for Michael's wedding, I did go there. I'm not gonna go this time, but it is pretty cool. Also, I walked back here and I didn't realize that there's some homeless people back here. I guess this is where they sleep at. Man, it sucks that there's homeless people, dude. It's like such a sharp contrast to the way we live our lives. If you're watching this video, chances are you're probably privileged enough to have a computer, a house, and all that. It's just weird, man. <sighs> Makes you feel like an idiot for living your life when you know that other people don't even have a place to stay at night. It's like here I am just walking around with the camera, taking pictures of things and saying, oh man, this is so cool. Ah, man. Well, I go take pictures of things and say this is so cool. I think this is like a Central Park almost. I don't know that for sure, but it seems quite big. Uh, maybe it's not the biggest park. The one in Chiyoda is bigger. Oh, that's the Imperial Palace. Maybe it is a Central Park type of deal. Here's a fun fact, I've never played a single game of baseball in my life. Looks fun though. So these signs here say the Tokyo Bunka Kaikan, which is Tokyo Cultural Hall or something. Not sure what that is, maybe like a concert hall? Oh, it is a concert thing. Nice. I'm gonna walk over to Akihabara now. Michael's eating breakfast right now and he's gonna meet me there. It should only take like 10 minutes though. I guess this is what the street looks like when everything's closed. Everything's shuttered right now. These small alleys with these little restaurants are so interesting. Wow, it's so cool, man. Rollerblade gang. <laughs> I think that this is the camping store that Rob went to because it's the same brand that his camping stove was. Let us go check it out. Wow, 
Wow, that place is like the Japanese REI. After carrying that 50 pound pack, I decided that I'm going ultra light, even if it bankrupts me. And I was looking at all those things in there. Man, some of that stuff, so expensive, but it's so light. It's like 160 grams, which is like less than a water bottle for an entire down jacket. Man. I found like the only non-crowded street in Tokyo. Yo, I have no clue what this is. I think this is just some sort of like little street with a bunch of artists and shops. It's actually under the train. Sweet, let's... The name emanates from railroad terminology expressing distance. 2K540, i.e. two kilometers and 540 meters away from the starting point at Tokyo Station. Oh. I think I'm too early. It's not even 11 o'clock yet, so everything is closed. Wow, this is really cool. I was walking by this the whole time and I didn't even realize it. Yeah, that bike is awesome. Okay, I guess it continues. Let's keep going to Akihabara. All the shops are closed anyway, so. I just came from that direction and Akihabara is this way. Also just received word from Brian and Andrew. They're on the plane. You know what's weird is that I don't like New York City at all. This place is not that much different when you think about it, but for whatever reason, I like this place. Maybe it's just because it's different. Like when you're in New York, it's just crowded and it's loud, but I already know how to speak the language. I know what I'm doing, so there's no adventure in it, you know? I don't know, let's think about that. Actually, the more I think about it is I don't have to live here. I can just go around doing whatever I want, eat garbage food, hang around. I don't have to actually live my life here. Everybody I've talked to who likes New York doesn't live there. Oh no, I've talked to lots of people who've lived there and like it. I don't know, it seems more manageable. Like New York seems so overwhelming all the time and it smells terrible and it's so loud. Anyways, this is not about New York, it's about Japan, let's go. Fire. Yeah. fire too. I sold this game. I used to have that. Crazy. Yeah. Pretty sure what they mean is please don't eat in here. But it's like here's four microwaves, but don't put food or beverages inside. <laughs> What'd you get? Oh, a donut. donut. Did you just microwave a donut? I did. We're living in the future. Birds in bikinis. <laughs> Tanuki is in bikinis. We're headed to Gotanda Station to find another book off. Today's goal is to find soundtracks and if possible, keep it under my new limit of 500 yen per item. That's not gonna be possible, but <laughs> We're gonna look for soundtracks, that's what I'm going for today. We'll, we'll show everyone what Michael got later. <laughs> Lot of space. <laughs> the space, period. <laughs> if you can see the road, it's not crowded. I don't know, I'm 
are pretty impressed. Like, they have, it's gotten really popular over here. You probably can see it on the news. Halloween, this is like, these, this is like Times oh, Square. Oh, I heard about that, yeah, 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 yeah. They actually had the first year that I went, they hadn't actually had police coming out to regulate it yet. From here to where we're going, it took us three hours. What? Because it was just solid, and you just had to squeeze between people. So we used a selfie stick, it was like a tour guide post, and it was just headed up in the air. <laughs> hey, what's this? Basketball street. With all of my heart. It's slightly bigger than regulation. Yeah, just a little bit bigger, <laughs> a little heavier. <laughs> Mmm. Like pretty good science. They're like a thousand yen. I mean, I'll get one. We can share it. Later. <laughs> <laughs> you open your eyes, Michael. There's beauty all around you. I mean, I see this and it's just... And it's just amazingly interesting. I know, I know. It's home. No, it's amazingly interesting. I got you, I got you. <laughs> like, I bet you if I went to Indiana, I could probably point out stuff that you've never seen. No. No, I've seen it all, it's very boring. <laughs> <laughs> right. Nope. It's like this scary restaurant you go to and it's a like it's like jail. Oh, I've heard about that. We're looking for a bathroom right now. I have had lots of success at the various book-offs, but now I must pee. Is this what passes for a burrito here? Yeah. You can get a Chipotle level burrito is at a place called, uh, I think it's called Frijoles or something like that. And it's really expensive. <laughs> this is the Japanese dollar store. Japanese dollar stores are amazing. It looks like the coolest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> Like cloud is gonna jump down any second now. Start his opening mission. <laughs> and next up, Tower Records. This is a place with lots of CDs. I've spent way too much money here before. We will attempt not to spend too much today. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently the composer of Final Fantasy XV was giving a talk and a mini live performance at two o'clock. It's like 3.15 right now. So we're gonna go downstairs and see if we can just like bust our way in <laughs> Peak. Got that poster, son. Yo. We were here at the exact time my favorite composer was downstairs. If that's not fate, I don't know what is. Somebody's playing something live over here. Headed to Rob's place for dinner. His wife Nessa has made some delicious Iranian food, which we are now going to go eat. But first, we're gonna go in the completely opposite direction to buy beers. 
very small. That's a personal size pizza? It's a very small pizza. Yeah, it's a personal size pizza. Yes. Get a couple. <laughs> <laughs> I may or may not have eaten that last night, <laughs> and it may or may not have been delicious. <laughs> okay, Rob and Nessa, sorry we're late, but we've brought beer and ice cream. So hopefully that will make up for our lateness. And also I got to meet my favorite composer of all time, so please forgive me for that reason. <laughs> Yeah, none of these roads existed the first time I came to Rob's house. <laughs> it was just big dirt fields. So I walked all the way down that road and I got there and there was no path. And I was like, okay. Actually, the last time I went to Rob's house, maybe a month or so ago, this wasn't here. That was there. Wow. We've been experiencing every type of Japanese environment. Suburbs, rural, mountains, city, you name it. Little Buddha. Mama Buddha. Whoa. Okay, no, this has to be new. If this is not new, then how on earth did I not put it in the vlog last year? What if I just like ripped out the rice and used it to make fresh rice tonight? <laughs> Harvested somebody else's rice. Ah, oh, Farin! She's good, man. Beshi. Beshi. Sab corn. Stop, corn. Oh, funny. That's fine, that's fine. That's perfect. Okay. Oh, I, I was just... <laughs> Whoa, what is that? That's rice. Rice. That's how you make the rice? In Iran, yes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> this is dinner tonight. Perfect. Yo, I don't deserve this. Like, I, I must have died and gone to heaven or something. <laughs> This is, we call it qayme. Beef and tomek and salt, pepper, cinnamon, tomato paste, and onions. And this one is brownies. lots of um, <laughs> 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 special brownies, brownies by the looks of it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> brownies, special green brownies, oh yeah. Um, no, just, it's that's not what it is. That's not legal. <laughs> <laughs> Parsley and konegi, spinach. Walnuts and eggs. Oh my god, dude. It's like Iranian meatloaf. Rice. 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 Safra. All right. And, yeah, bread. and bread. And bread. Well, homemade bread. Itadakimasu. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Nessa and Rob, for the wonderful dinner. I'm so full, I'm about to burst. I'm so tired, I'm about to die. Yes, thank you. Delicious, as always. Can't wait I to eat it, some more. I give it one big thumbs up, just like that. We missed our train, so we're gonna look at these. Good time in there. Yeah, 